but don't feel like doing that anymore. I don't feel like that's an expense I want to pay to me. So we're not doing that. <laughs> wow, my background is real ghetto right now. I'm not gonna lie. This room is a literal mess. <clears throat> I'm literally trying to like just get a little clip in before I have to leave and my sister and her boyfriend are in my ears going off about food. Wow, I don't know how to feel at all. What happens to be my blood and I'm gonna stand by it. You know the TikTok <laughs> You know, bro, you know, deceased. I've done that before too. But that's horrible because when you get home, you realize that. So the other day, the other day, my ask, uh, she, uh, we went on the road. She asked me what I want. So I said, I want, I said, I want a sausage, bacon, egg, and cheese on a croissant. This sandwich is a bacon, egg, and cheese, and you add the sausage, right? So typically when you go, if you ask for bacon, egg, and cheese, sometimes they forget the sausage. So he bought it and he came out and he came out with theme food and whatever and it didn't have the sausage, bro. And I'm like, where's the sausage? And I'm so, oh my gosh, I literally told the man and it looked like him spaghetti. And I'm like, yeah, but I, I wanted the sausage. The sausage makes the sandwich. Can you go back? <laughs> bro, he was flabbergasted. He's like, as in you're literally not going to eat the sandwich because it don't have the sausage. Yeah, I wanted the sausage. And I repeated the order twice before he went in the store. What Mikhail say? No, Mikhail. And I'm not, I will eat, I will eat whatever. I am not very particular, but the, the, that sandwich, it tasted so bland without the sausage. Okay, so don't talk. Anyways, guys, so I'm ready. We're about to go drop off some shit for my sister. And I didn't realize until today, until right now, that the place is, I didn't realize that the place was an hour and like 21 minutes away and the later the longer this man is taking to come is the longer it's gonna take us to get there and I don't think he knows either that it's literally an hour and 21 minutes away and I'm mad and he's gonna be mad so I need to be able to make up for that and I can't so I'm in a bit of a pickle anyways I'm pretty much ready to go I was gonna wear a sweater just now that I stole but I can't explain yet why I stole the sweater so I opted against wearing it as i'm talking about that i'm gonna look in this bag here to see if there's anything else i need cop a sweater or two out of this bag here i'm literally trying to see how many of these sweaters i could like take away you know i like this one too yeah, i like this and other day give me sweatpants and i felt like he gave it to me just to shut me up because i was offended i took it but i felt some type of way that's not how I wanted it. I wanted to steal it. So he gave me one to shut me up and he also bought me one. So cute. Energy is transferable. I'm gonna really... It's not the energy I'm striving for. Okay? So I'm, I'm gonna need you guys to fake it when I come on the phone. Because the bad energy is not working out for me. What is so hilarious? Okay, well, maybe y'all should try that at some point. Successful little date night. This was not supposed to be a date night. This was supposed to be me dropping shit off for my sister and it turned into a date night, not complaining. Had a glass of something, pink Moscato or whatever. Cotton candy Moscato. It's pretty good. It didn't taste anything like cotton candy. However, we're wrapping up the night. We're going home. I gotta pee. Guys, I just realized that this entire time I did not vlog anything, but I was trying to like live in the moment and be in the moment. So today pretty much consisted of us coming to New Jersey to drop off something for my sister. I feel like I'm literally so full. I can barely speak, breathe, or function. And that is not even me being dramatic. So today consisted of us coming to New Jersey to drop off something for my sister, which we did. It was very quick. I just handed the girl the bag and that was it. We're ready to go. And then it ended up turning into a date night, which was long overdue, might I add. It was long overdue. So that was pretty good. Um, I ate steak and broccoli and like, what was that thing? Mashed potato, really, really good. And I ate more than I expect myself to eat a lot of the times because most times I eat like the bare minimum and then I'm literally full. So that was pretty good. 
And now we're gonna take this long ass drive back home, an hour and 46 minutes, and it's well after 5 p.m. So it's 6:12. So it's gonna take a minute. And I'm liquored up. <laughs> so I'm probably gonna be sleeping this entire time. So hopefully the sleeping passenger does not affect the driver because that would not be good at all. I might just leave because I feel like I'm a little bit tired anyways that's all I did today I didn't vlog but I have like some little snippets of like the food so I'll insert it here so you guys can see um what I pretty much did today but that's pretty much all and then tomorrow I go back to work very very tragic I feel like the day after my day off is always so damn rough because I'm never really ready to go back to work but once I'm at work like I'm in the swing of things so I guess that's pretty good but that's all room doing paperwork because i'm so tired and i just do not wish to be called for the next literal 30 minutes because i leave in 30 minutes and i literally just want to stay here and do this paperwork and just leave in 30 minutes i do not want the stress i had a stressful morning and i feel like that was enough stress for one day that was a whole workout as i'm talking about workout i want to start working out again but i need to get in the mood get the momentum to do that again because honestly that's I gotta work myself up to that point. Not there yet. I don't know if when I go home, I'm gonna feel like that. I need to watch something and see if I can get motivated, but I have to wait until I go home to see if that even happens. I'm trying not to sleep when I go home. I was gonna go to the nail salon today, but don't feel like doing that anymore. I don't feel like that's an expense I wanna pay today. So we're not doing that. <laughs> so I have to see. I'm just here, chilling, stressed. Tell me how I just managed to find some salt mackerel inside of the fridge. I'm about to throw down and bake some sweet potato in the microwave to eat with that. What is on this shirt? 